Hello, I'm Dr. Mark Alberts, Physician-in-Chief of the Eye and Neuroscience Institute, which is part of Hartford HealthCare, and I'm reporting to you from the annual American Academy of Neurology meeting here in Philadelphia. Welcome to this Medscape update. A lot of great science presented at this annual meeting. I wanted to focus on one study that really caught my eye. This was a large study from University of Texas at Houston that looked at over three million deliveries and looked at the risk of stroke related to pregnancy and delivery. So this was a very large study and what they found is that during the last part of pregnancy, the third trimester, and early postpartum, particularly the first month or two, there was a significantly elevated risk of cerebral hemorrhage. Now, prior studies have shown an increased risk of stroke during and after pregnancy, but a lot of those strokes were ischemic strokes. This is one of the few and very large studies to show that increased risk of cerebral hemorrhage, which is among the worst types of strokes you could have. What's underneath this increased risk of cerebral hemorrhage? It, it's really unclear. We know that when it comes to ischemic stroke in pregnancy, there are clotting factors, there's increased blood viscosity, uh, eclampsia and preeclampsia that could predispose to ischemic stroke. But what about hemorrhagic stroke? Well, we know that there may be dysfunction of cerebral autoregulation during pregnancy, particularly late um, third trimester and early postpartum that could um, be subserving some of this. And then again, eclampsia and preeclampsia can cause some issues with blood vessel stability and the structural integrity of the wall. Perhaps that is also uh, increasing the risk of hemorrhagic stroke. But this is certainly an area that requires more research and better understanding so that we can do a better job preventing strokes. I mean, strokes at any time are devastating, but especially in, in a woman who's pregnant or just gave birth. So stay tuned. I'm sure this is an area of active research, and I hope we can give you updates on this in the future. Thank you for your attention. This is Dr. Mark Alberts reporting from the Ameri American Academy of Neurology in Philadelphia for Medscape. Thank you.